I, I guess everybody's favorite favorite thing is uh, the Gucci bag. Sure. I mean, everywhere she went. Oh, I think I have a story to tell. I, I, world stories, okay, that no one will ever hear because no one knows to ask these questions. Um, <clears throat> supposedly, in, in Missy Hyatt's Gucci bag, there was it was loaded. This is Jim Ross. Thanks, Jim Ross. Me, <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm like uh, urban legend, and a few other people. Um, carried a, uh, it was a loaded Gucci bag with a brick. Okay. I picked up a brick today and if she had hit me in the head with the thing, I would like, you know, half my head would be like caved in right here. I wouldn't be able to talk to you. I'd be drooling. All right. Or dead. Um, so the whole scenario was it was a loaded Gucci bag and she would just clobber me with it. And sometimes I would get the bag away from her and hit her with it. So it, um, came up to the point where, hmm, how did the whole thing originate? Just her carrying her bag, and then she'd hit me, and then I'd get it back and hit her. Um, I, I'm, I'm trying to think, what what else? Uh, it would just kind of originated from a skit, and we just played it out, you know? Oh, what are your memories, though, of you guys spent a lot of ring time together, and you both hadn't had a lot of ring time before? Anything that uh, popped, the actual in time, inside the ring. That's what I mean. You guys oh, spent a lot of time outside oh, the ring. Okay, but. so I think what happened is we're managers. The very special, rare era that came about, and I think that the ones that were in it needed to realize that we created that, and it can't be undone. And I'm not trying to bat, brag or have a big head, but. You're welcome, we, we we were doing that at the time, and I wasn't conscious of what was happening and what was being creative. So now I look back, and I walked away from wrestling, and um, I, I did a lot of other things. And you know, oh, now I'm like you. almost like taking my my place in that I was part of this. I can't I can't undo the past, and, and that's exactly what was going on. So. I'm uh, picking up the the slack, and I'm uh, acknowledging, you know, what evolved and where I came from, and I'm part of it. I can't um, erase that, so I, I'm here today. So I, I don't know, it, it, Missy Hyatt and that, hi guys. <laughs> um, that was a thing where you know they want to see the 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 managers because at the time we weren't wrestlers, obviously, and we still aren't. Uh, would clash, so they like to see a lot of hair movement, me pulling her hair, I'm tossing her around, and, um, and so they, they find different matches and, and angles with us, with uh, Missy Hyatt and that, so all Good. fun. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it, and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Support us on Patreon.com for $1.99 a month to watch our full shoot interviews ad-free and help our channel grow. Follow us on Twitter at The Hannibal TV for instant updates.